In human body, there is a pair of filtration and extractor organs. They are called kidneys. The filtration function of the kidneys occurs in about one million spherical structures, and these spherical structures are called glomeruli. Under normal conditions, the plasma protein in the glomerular capillaries is controlled by the intact filtration barrier and goes along with blood flow. Only micromolecular substances such as metabolites of normal organism, creatinine and micromolecular protein can go through the filtration barrier. In renal capsular space, and then be passed out with urine. Pathological changes in different parts of the kidney lead to different pathological types of kidney disease. The onset of minimal change disease is usually associated with microbes and allergens. Microbes and allergens can enter the body through nose, throat, skin, and other ways to make immune system abnormal. Our immune system consists of thymus, lymphos, spleen, and other immune organs, immune cells, and the immunological active factors secreted by cells. The abnormal immune organs can activate effector T cells to release vascular permeability factors. These vascular permeability factors go along with blood flow into glomerular capillaries, leading to damage. Meanwhile, they go through filtration barrier, cause food pros fusion and increased aperture between the food process. Glomerular capillary podocytes learn is the pathological manifestation of minimal change disease. Only under ultra microstructure can you see glomerular with thorough epithelial cell, podocyte fusion. Micromolecular protein will go through the damaged filtration barrier into renal capsular space. However, and light microglomerular are all normal and it's difficult to find out the damaged extent of podocyte structure caused by permeability factors. Micromolecular protein Metabolite waste and water in capsular space pass through the renal tubulars out of kidneys, forming proteinuria. This is minimal change disease.